Welcome back to our Simple Learning. Um, today we are going to discuss about the 25 intermediate level phrases. It means something like the daily um, conversation that you could, you could hear from, from the people or the daily conversation that you could encounter and you could say um, in different um, conversations, in during your lesson, during your you during your working with your colleagues, something like that. So today, something we could just um discuss the three or four at the moment, um like for the ans for the asking questions like, how is it going? You could say, you could say going, not going. Instead of going, sounds like very stiff, very very stiff um um intonation there. So you should um reduce or you should um not to say the g like how is it going like that going not going how is it going something like that oh how how is it going and then something like how are you something like that the question is generally generally um about how are you so you could say i'm good i'm good thank you you should say that always say thank you i'm good thank you Oh, it's it's all well, thanks, something like that. So the next one would be, what have you been up to? Something like that. Like someone could o would always say to you, what have you been up to? And um, you could always answer like, I've been, I've been like that. I've been, not I have been, not I have been. But if you are writing an essay or when you are studying or writing an email, Rather, you could you you should always um include the I have not do not do not um short it into I've I've, but when you are speaking, you could say I've I've been busy, I've been working, I've been planting in my garden, something like that. So I've you have to short it I've, but when you are writing, you you always have to say I have been. I have been. So that's a different one from speaking and writing. So then the last one would be how have you been how have you been doing? Or what how how have you been from the last time I've seen you? Something like that questions that you could always hear from from your daily life here in the UK <laughs> or whenever you are talking with the um Western people, English people, something like that. So, well, you could always answer it like it's the same, like, what have you been? You could also like, I've been busy. I've been working. I've been studying. I've been doing a lot. I've been very busy at work, something like that. So always the the questions with have is um, a short way to respond. Like, I've, 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 I've. But when you are writing, you have to include the I have been. So that's a different one. So, so yeah, that's, that, that's it for now for the our um, intermediate level phrases that you could always um, encounter to talk with um, Western people or English people. So do, you, you could pronounce it properly. Be, be careful with going going and going because going is something like it's it's very it's some um, very um how could you say it? the the intonation there should be going not going something it's it's like a verb when you say going is like you are um telling something about using that word as a verb but if you could say how is it going like that it sounds like you're asking how are you so don't confuse with going and going. <laughs> um, so same like how are you doing? You you could if you are asking you could, you should also say how are you doing like that doing doing not doing how are you doing? Oh, I'm doing good. That's it. I'm doing good. Thank you. Like like that. You should always also respond when they ask you how are you? How are you? When someone's asking you, how are you? And then you should answer, I'm good. Thank you. How about you? you, you. 
as a polite way, as a polite way here in British, you should also ask questions. Um, how are you? When they ask you how are you, you and you should say I'm I'm good, thanks. How about you? Something like that. But if if you should always say, but if you're comfortable to the people to or to the person who who ask that question, you could you could say, I'm not doing so well. I'm not doing good. I'm not doing not bad. Something like that. Thank you. How about you? Something like that. So you sh those are the British manner um, phrases phrases that you could always hear when you get here in the UK or when you're talking with um, English or Western people. So that's it for now for our um, intermediate level phrases. So I I hope you learned something. <laughs> again so um thank you for keep watching my videos don't forget my live session on friday i will give um 100 pesos for each to five lucky winners so just keep um liking commenting on my um videos thanks a lot guys bye for now bye